everyone and welcome back to The Sims 4. We are here with Lily who is looking a little bit nervous and that is because today is a very special day. She just got promoted. She is now a moon mongrel and she is getting ready uh, to, <laughs> well, propose to her lovely Zoe. So it's a big day, big day coming up, big change. She has now been pr uh, promoted finally to the moon mercenary excuse me i knew as soon as i said mongrel that was wrong i started laughing because i was like no she's not a mongrel she's a whatchamacallit a mercenary but she is indeed a moon mercenary now and she is totally ready this is very exciting but she is totally ready to have her life move along with zoe so the lovely zoe who is also getting a little bit older who needs some good old tlc some good attention I love how she still keeps her bright, <laughs> her bright, bright, bright eyelid uh, liner stuff. I, I don't wear makeup, so I'm a little bit like, what's that called again? Eyeshadow. There we go. There we go. Oh my goodness. I'm almost as nervous as you are, Lily. I'm so excited about this, but Zoe was not promoted today, but hopefully tomorrow she will, or well, I guess next week, because she's got quite a bit of time, she will be promoted as well. So I think it's time to go ahead and have the lovely ladies now that they're official adults and that Lily has officially hit the level that she wanted to be at in her job time to propose time for them to get married I think that Zoe would want kind of a bigger wedding so that'll be that'll be exciting and we'll have to see I think pine ages up pretty soon let me check really quick yeah pine ages up like in two days so as soon as pine ages up we're going to adopt a baby for these two so that's very exciting as well but this is going to be their date night this is going to be the night where lily goes ahead and proposes and first things first they're both tired so they're going to drink some sleep replacement potions we'll just pretend it's like a nice drink that they they could get from the place they're at oh lily don't be shy don't be don't be feeling down let's see call someone on the phone because she's embarrassed Go ahead, come over here. Ask for reassurance. You gotta be able to, to get support from your partner, you know? I guess that was a pleasant conversation. <laughs> like my jaw was kind of dropped because I was like, that doesn't look like a happy conversation. But they seem to be doing quite well. Meet someone new, chat. Oh, Olivia. What? There's someone there's someone coming along to do a rude introduction who's wearing like a spooky hood. What's going on? What's happening? I'm a little bit confused. Is that Olivia? Are you Olivia? No, that's Victoria. She's very lovely. That was weird. Like we have a little stalker somewhere nearby. But yeah, basically we're just gonna let the ladies is that Katie? That is Casey! Wow, she's an elder now. We're gonna let them have a great night at this beautiful new lot. This is one of the gallery lots from uh, the various amazing creators that we have out there in the Sims world. And I wanted to try this out. It just looked really cute. So I plunked it down and this is a lovely lounge. It's got a fantastic little like piano up top. Oh my gosh, and look at all of this. Oh, it is popping in here. This will be a nice place for them just to meet with everybody and have a good day. Oh, there's the Olivia lady. Oh my gosh, what a mystery. Oh my gosh, look at her. <laughs> oh my goodness, hang on, this woman. Look at this woman. Are you kidding me? That's awesome, you guys. Wow. Wow. We'll have to watch out for her. She might like put something poisonous in our drinks. But yeah, let's go ahead. Oh, Lily, I see where that hand's going, ma'am. Oh, let's see. Oh, let's do point out constellations really quickly. Because that's always so cute. I love the way Zoe walks. She's just so adorable. Oh, she's headed off to do something. Go to the restroom. All right, well, we could be polite. All right, and then let's see, meet someone new. So they're both feeling like getting out and just like introducing themselves to people tonight. So why don't we come over? Uh, why don't we say hello to this lovely woman? Like, hello, hello. Uh, let's just do a friendly introduction. Oh, she's tense. Why are you tense? Needs amusement. Oh, she needs to do something fun, huh? Well, let's come on in here. Someone's playing the piano upstairs. 
not very well, but she's trying. We've got dancing to do, people to meet, win a game of chess. So yeah, they'll have a nice night out. Zoe, are you ready to come over? She totally is. Oh, she wants to come order a drink. That's awesome. Come and enjoy yourself, my girls. Tonight's a special night. Mostly I just want to work on filling as many of their... Oh, look, Lily's ordering a drink. This is so cool. Watching them do it on their, their own and not me ordering them, too. Wow, there's so many Sims here. We need to get out more often. We're so distracted with, like, the kids. With those... Oh, I see those, like, little butterfly sort of flower things. And I'm like, oh, I want to pick them. Oh, what's this? Ooh, it's a wild snapdragon flower. <gasps> Look at it. It's so cute. It's so cute. Of course, like, there's a party going on inside. I think there's something wrong with it. Look at it. That flower is just, like, hanging in the air. That's funny. But, yeah, of course, I would, I would be distracted. There we go. This is going to make Zoe happy because she has not yet been allowed to introduce herself to 10 Sims. So we're going to make sure she could do a friendly introduction. And friendly introduction. And she's just going to go around and introduce herself to a ton of people. It's not a date because the dates always have the same actions. And I figured we would just work on completing some of Zoe's eagerness to be able to, to introduce herself to people and just make friends. Let's see, how many people have we introduced to now? We only need to introduce ourselves to two more. She's waiting for her drink and the bartender is like too busy chit-chatting. Aww, she's going to compliment Lily's new appearance. That's adorable. Okay, this Olivia woman's actually hilarious. I, I love her. Wearing the little, like, Grim Reaper hood. Oh, Olivia wants to do a rude introduction. What's her problem with us? Where's the bartender going? We haven't gotten our drink. I don't want a drink from Olivia. I think she'd put, like, poison apples in it. She po po. Oh, do we have, like, a... Ooh, just one more person to introduce ourselves to. <laughs> I love how she just, like, sassed her away. She's like, nah, get away from me. Oh, do we know this person? Blakely! It's so amazing to see, like, all of the people get older now. Oh, we know this guy! Travis! So she wants to come over and be friendly with Travis. We can manage that. Let's come meet uh, the Jordan lady. They look like they'd make kind of a cute couple, these two. Wait, Travis, where are you going? Lily, what are you up to? She's still chit-chatting, but she's not getting a lot of entertainment. The bartender just, like, walked outside. We have a new bartender now. But he just, like, wandered outside to stare at the, the little thing. Oh, Lily's having a good time. Oh, wait, a boring conversation with these two. So why don't we go ahead and let Lily come up here and play. She seems to be getting along really well with uh, Deja, so let's invite Deja to play chess, because Lily wants to win a chess game. She has level 10 logic. I think that's going to happen. Oh, we've learned that Jordan is uh, insane. Okay. I wonder what that means. All right. Oh, look at this. Meet someone new in three different locations. Achieve charisma skill level four. We finally, finally am getting poor Zoe's little thing, like, perked up a bit. Oh, I'm so glad. All right. Is Travis upstairs? Is he still here? Because we want to be friendly with him. Travis. No, Travis, come here. We've got to tell you a joke. Um, uh, heartfelt compliment. And then funny... Uh, joke about politicians. Stay here, Travis. Actually, we should tell you, uh, tell a joke about ducks. I like that. I like that one a lot better. I love Zoe's little walk. She's just so adorable when she walks. Lily, are you having fun? Lily, go upstairs. You're not having fun. Go upstairs and play some chess. You'll be happy if you play some chess. Play with, uh, whoops. Come on. Play with Deja. I think that'll work out. Zoe, how's it going? Oh, now she's wanting. Now we're getting there. She's wanting to talk to Lily about her day. Make a new friend. Let's do a knock knock joke to raise up. Oh wait, I guess that'll raise up. Um, discuss interest. 
<laughs> Friendly. Orphan. Kabura. Maybe just get to know. There, maybe she can make a new friend while we're here. Oh, and she's really hungry, so we'll need to feed her too. Oh, who's this? I love your your color coordination. Oh my gosh, look, she's wearing the little plum bob earrings. Oh. Wow, she's she's adorable. Is she a young adult? Nope, she's an adult. All right, getting to know better. Oh, now she wants to chat with Deja. Oh, and she wants to hug someone. That's adorable. We know who we want to hug. All right, where's Lily? Playing by herself, of course. So she wants to do research on the computer, win a game of chess. So let's go ahead and we're just gonna send Zoe up here. Why not? But yeah, this is this is just a nice little date that they're having. I love how she is just totally dressed to be playing the piano. Victoria, excellent attempts. You're definitely learning. I love your dress. It's very pretty. I should get it for Lily. Excellent attempts at learning how to play the piano. Oh, and now we're having uh, Jordan give it a try. No? Okay, she gave it her try. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, there we go. And now the ladies can spend some time together. All right, why don't you go ahead and join the game? Let's let Lily get happy by winning her little game of chess. I don't think it'll take very long. Oh, look, and we've got uh, Jay Huntington the third. Oh, you're an adult now! Man, it's so fun to see just the whole town age and develop. And so many of you have sent ideas to me for Sims to add in that are from your guys' world. And you can keep doing that. I'm so sorry. Don't worry, Nick. I will be adding Stinson in. I haven't forgotten. And now that my kids are getting older and apparently are currently miserable, I have no idea why, <laughs> I will be working on that. Look, oh. Oh, they're so cute. I really think it's adorable. Oh, look at Lily's little face. I think it's adorable. I feel like like Zoe taught Lily to be a bit more a bit more like outgoing and to enjoy just learning more about people. And Lily, meanwhile, has brought Zoe into a world she never really thought she'd enjoy of science and space adventures and aliens. <laughs> So it's really cute. They've really complimented each other as a couple. Oh, and now they're gonna be a real couple. I think Zozo would want a proper wedding. So we'll try to build up a proper wedding for her, considering she has almost no friends, but she is like the Sim who would want the most friends. We're gonna work on fixing that. Did you win? She won, yay! And now she's feeling confident, all right. Oh, and she wants to kiss Zoe, chat with Bob, propose a crazy scheme to someone. So let's go ahead. Friendly. Where's the crazy scheme? Propose crazy scheme. So, let's think about this. What if we got married? <laughs> oh my goodness, is it really almost Iris's birthday? That's amazing. What do you think about that idea? She's like, oh, I don't know. It might be a good idea getting married. I could see it. Heartfelt compliment, romance, um, oh there it is, embrace. I always am like looking for hug and half the time it's embrace. But they haven't had a lot of time just to hang out together. Oh, the ladies, oh there you go. Because look at how low their little love has gotten. And that's, that's not right. Oh here, compliment someone. Compliment her outfit, it's adorable. Oh, I love how they're just like chit-chatting about each other too. <laughs> Show off muscles. That's so funny. All right, let's see. Express fondness. Suave kiss, because she's feeling confident now. She's like, Zoe took to the hypothetical marriage question pretty well. Oh my gosh, Lily, she looks so proud of herself. Look at that. Oh, that's adorable! Then let's see. Level up in handiness. Lily, you're so romantic. Level up in handiness skill. Oh my gosh. Uh, ask Lily about her day. Let's see. If I to stay the night, you guys live in the same house. Whisper seductively. Um, let's go ahead and ask about day just to get that out of the way. Let's see. 
there. See, they're getting pretty happy. Get to know Lily? What do you mean? You know this woman. I guess that's a good thing. We might as well slow down and get to know for a second. I just love satisfying their wants and making sure that they're they're really happy. Alright, let's do that. Oh, Zoe has learned the following traits about Lily. She's a genius. That's adorable. Alright, let's do share ideas. So, let's see. Um... Because I just want them to, like, be super happy, share brilliant ideas, and then compliment the fact that she's good to <laughs> reveal brilliant invention. Invite to stay the night. You guys live together. They're so silly. Compliment outfit. We'll level up the handiness skill later, Lily. Come on, focus on what's in front of you. Talk to Deja later. Don't want to be mischievous right now. We'll level up in the Christmas skill. We're not going to watch comedy on TV. Not happening. Come on. Be mischievous. Gracious, these two. They're such geese. All right. I think it's been a pretty good date. Get to know Zoe. I'm really surprised they don't know each other, like, fully. But let's go ahead and get to know. Lie about career? No, you don't need to lie about your career. Be proud about your career. Let's blow a kiss. And now she's getting really hungry. Oh, that's so cute. And then, let's see. They're so cute. They're just flirting together on their own now. Flirt. Do, 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 do. And then, let's see. Offer oh, massage seems like something that Zoe would do. Oh, it's been so long since I've seen the massage. And then, let's see, hold hands. And express fondness. And then let's go outside where it's really pretty over by these trees. Oh, now they're feeling flirty. That's adorable. <gasps> Nilly just reached the uh, charisma skill. That's awesome. She can upload images on the computer and sweet talk other sims. So let's have them come out here where it's nice and pretty. Now that they're both feeling flirty. We're not going to be mischievous, you goose goose. She wants to become happy. That's adorable. But she's getting really hungry, so we'll send him home in just a second. But now that, like, dawn is breaking, Lily's like, oh, she's so lovely. All right, then let's see. Be enticing. Sexy pose. Profess undying love seems appropriate. And then... Let's see... Oh, 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 uh, off a rose, and then, do, 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 oh, passionate kiss, all right, and then once we get it all lined up, we can just sit back and admire the adorableness of proposing, Yee! okay, there we go, everything's all set up, now we can just sit back, Oh, I love it when they do the rose. I really hope, oh, wouldn't it be so fun if we could like put the flowers in pots and sell them in the upcoming expansion pack? <laughs> An adorable passionate kiss and then as the sun rises over the horizon, Lily shall ask Zoe. <laughs> Oh, she's so nervous. Oh, look at the little heart. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Lily, get your freaking plum bob out of the way. There. We're safe from the plum bob. Oh, it. oh my goodness. Oh, look at the little heart. Oh, that's so cute! That's such a Zoe thing to do, to jump in like to her arms like that. <gasps> yay! Yeah, I took like a bazillion screenshots, because yay! They are engaged! And now I think they will go home, 
they will tend to their mood super happy they needed that that oh planned wedding event <gasps> elope immediately with lily oh that's adorable i think that zoe would want to throw a party uh so we will work on that but yeah now zoe has a few days she's gonna start making friends meet different people in different locations i think she'll go with the family because today's saturday and tate is going to take the kids to the park so i think that uh our lovely our lovely zoe here is gonna go with everybody look at how happy lily looks she looks so serious but so happy like so content i'm so happy for her Oh, Lily girl. But all right. So now we're going to send everybody to the park. Lily's going to have to go to work, but everyone else can go and enjoy a nice day at the park. And we'll see if the kids, like Pine, can make enough friends to be able to complete a social butterfly interaction or not. Which would really, like, oh, That would suck, but we'll try harder next time. And I will see you guys next time because just look at these two. We have a wedding to plan. We have a, a really awesome little pine to send out on his teenage year.